The best news for Trump tonight, that new battleground poll in Ohio that has him leading there, which is why Hillary Clinton is there. So is ABC Cecilia Vega. In Ohio today, it seemed like Hillary Clinton couldn't wait to get in front of the microphone and rip into Donald Trump. As Toledo is the kind of place where people work hard, look after one another, and yes, pay their taxes, right? Here in the battleground, Trump is winning, Clinton not letting up. Here's my question, what kind of genius loses a billion dollars in a single year? But Clinton now facing heat herself over leaked comments she made back in February during a closed door fundraiser about young Bernie Sanders supporters. They're children of the Great Recession and they are living in their parents' basement. Uh, they feel that they got their education and the jobs that are available to them are not at all what they envisioned for themselves. And they don't see much of a future. Trump says Clinton was being nasty to Sanders supporters, but her old rival coming to her defense. What she was saying there is absolutely correct. With the next debate just six days away, Clinton hoping for a repeat of the first one, now fodder for SNL. My microphone is broken. <laughs> she broke it with Obama. She and Obama stole my microphone. They took it to Kenya. They took my microphone to Kenya and they broke it and now it's broken. <laughs> Secretary Clinton, what do you think about that? I think I'm going to be president. <laughs> the real life Hillary Clinton today all smiles, raising a fist in the air, celebrating an endorsement from one of Ohio's most famous sons, LeBron James. The NBA superstar writing, we need a president who brings us together and keeps us unified. Policies and ideas that divide us more are not the solution. And Cecilia Vega joining us live from Akron, Ohio. And tomorrow night, Cecilia, we all know the VP debate. And what are you learning tonight from your sources on both sides about the stakes here? David, Tim Kaine essentially needs to debate two men tomorrow night, Mike Pence and Donald Trump. For Mike Pence, though, the pressure is on for him to overcome Donald Trump's performance during that last debate. Most Americans say he lost that one. For Mike Pence, David, he's got to come out swinging tomorrow night. Cecilia Vega live in Ohio. Cecilia, thank you. And tomorrow night right here, you can see the VP debate on ABC 9 p.m. Eastern. And then on Sunday, the second presidential debate, just six days away now, co-moderated by our own Martha Raddatz. Of course, we'll have full team coverage and the debate right here on ABC.